stop sinking on one, two, three. One, two, three. Can I get a hell yeah? Hell yeah. Everyone, give me your best Stone Cold impression. Sink, sink for that Jacob, Felix, I need your Stone Cold. What? What? I need your Stone Cold insane. What? <laughs> <laughs> During a podcast? <laughs> what? <laughs> Welcome back to the bus. <laughs> Do you need me to? Do you need me to get the? Do you need it? <laughs> My bad. All right, we're professionals, guys. Professionals. Uh, <laughs> Wait. Do you? Keanu, are you good? Can, I, can I get your best Stone Cold impression? What? 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 All, right, I'm All right. That was that was, that was, that was, that was a good one. That was a good okay. one. Okay. I'm sorry. All right. <laughs> oh my god. You want to lead us in? <laughs> I hope that stays in or it goes out because I don't know how that's gonna go down with uh, people. Yeah, it's fine. I'm making my job. Oh my god, my throat hurts from that. <laughs> uh, just to start this off, Jacob Felix, uh, you know, new nickname every w- new week, uh, yeah. had me crying earlier over a Stone Cold impression. Pokemon and Stone Cold should never mix people. Yes, sir. Oh my I think God. that it should, and it did, and it was great. Uh, oh, <laughs> God. Okay. That might be the worst start to the Buckle Bomb we've ever had. We get worse every time. It's fine. Okay. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Listeners, go ahead and leave a comment. Uh, your favorite worst open so far to date. It's the best worst open. Oh my opening. god! Best worst. I'm dying. Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Daniel Ryan Primo. That's me. Host of the Buckle Bomb. Nice. You deserve it. Congrats. I don't deserve it. I don't think we have a button for that. You lost. I God should definitely have what a you, button. Uh, oh, boy. Yeah, you had to bring it up. Anyways. <laughs> yeah, that's me. Host of the Buckle Bomb, Starboy, all those things. Uh, we're also here with... Yeah, hello. <coughs> it's I, uh, Mr. Mentally Stable, Felix <laughs> Rogers here. Uh, <laughs> you know, the nickname's really more of a formality at this point. Um, but we do have a very special guest with us here today. Wait, we forgot the man in the building. Oh, True. Wow, you really don't like yourself today. Yeah, Jay Mazing, he's in, in the building. The Woo, building. The there you go. He said the line. I mean, he's always getting sounds or anything. Guest. You said what? Do you get a sound? Oh, yeah. All right. There's a special yeah. guest in the building. Special yeah. guest. Yeah. Some call him loco, some call him crazy. We like to call him insane. That was off the cuff, baby. Ooh, the one and only. I did that just, just now. That one. I did that just now with all my brain power after the stone cold bit. <laughs> The ten hour Stone Cold bit. Ten hour Stone Cold. Ten hours. Pretty, pretty close. Um, <clears throat> yeah. What's up, Insane? I what's can't believe we haven't had you on, dude. That's that's Man, weird. I'm I'm excited to be here. Uh, thanks for the invite. Uh, I've been looking forward to it. I've been watching y'all's videos. Yeah? yeah. You a fan? Yeah, I'm a fan, man. Dude, yeah. every time someone says they watch our podcast, I'm like, ah, you don't have to joke around. I know. Right? We, 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 we appreciate cool. you watching what we put out and being like, man, I want to be on that. <laughs> <laughs> People <laughs> come break. and say that. People say mm-hmm. that they want to be on this, and I'm like, quit, quit lying. Where, Why are you lying to me? Yeah, I remember you saying there were people... Co- uh, a couple of people that came to the school because they heard the book. Yeah, some people have oh, listened to this right. podcast and they came to the school and they said that they liked our podcast and they came here because of the podcast. Yo, shout outs to the YouTube algorithm doing us favor. Uh, yeah, man. Uh, Lord knows. Putting us on. Knows something like that. In- insane. Yes. Ah, you get it? It's crazy. You the joke? <laughs> Anyways, uh, first of all, I want to ask, how many masks do you have? On the top of my head, I don't remember, but it's close to 25, if not 25. <laughs> Heck yeah. yeah. How many of them are damaged? Because I've seen one. I think I've seen one picture of one that's like torn up and like Oh, bloody. okay. Like that? Uh, yeah. I think there's only two out there like that. Only that's two out silver there? silver one, yes. And another gold one, I think. Dude, how did you... Okay, can you take me through those masks getting torn up? Because I actually don't know the stories. I've only seen the, the pictures. Uh, one of them, which is the one on the silver one, this mm-hmm. one, I got teamed up by old school domination, man. It was three Bad on dudes. one. Yeah. And they, that's how they stole my championship because I was the tag team champion mm-hmm. with Manny Domingo. And uh, so they beat me up because I wasn't old school. So Jeez. <laughs> and they tore that up uh, and <laughs> busted me open, as you see in, in the videos and stuff. Uh, and then Ryo came over and he helped me. Oh, Ryo. Yeah. Shout yeah. out. Ryo. Ryo. Good that's good, man. Bad. We've had him on <laughs> once you, before. Your own brain, um, your brother. Four-time tag team champion, by the way. Four times, just with El Rio alone. Just El Rio alone. How did that come to be, you and El Rio? How did that? How did that come into fruition? Uh, well, honestly, uh, we both started training kind of at the same time. Mm-hmm. It was me, Johnny Cruz, and Rio. Mm-hmm. And in that order, or, or no? 
I think so. yeah, I think so because Johnny Cruz was the last one to sign up. Um, <laughs> and yeah, it was. We just started training by like together, and we got <laughs> pretty along together. And he told me that he wanted like a lucha gimmick. And he kind of, like, asked me some questions about gear and, like, so I kind of led him through it. And I guess Pop saw that connection and uh, he, like, gave us an opportunity to tag team and see what, like, each other is like and stuff. Like, if we like each other, like, yeah. we click. But at first, <coughs> uh, Lucha Legion was actually a four-piece group. I was going to ask. Yeah, yeah I, I've seen started, that before. And it wasn't uh, Adam, Prince Adam. Prince uh, Adam. Yes, he was the leader. And uh, some Puerto Rican guy, I forgot his name, Electro, I think it was. Ew. Yeah, Electro. Yeah. Kenneth's nodding yes. Yeah, he so was yeah. here for a while. <laughs> uh, but yes, um, it was four of us, and we took over. We were here at the time. We took over We all the championships. I, I, uh, I've seen that. That's a dominating the, the photo I've up seen. In, yeah. up, in, uh, up in the office. Yeah, yeah. exactly. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And we busted him open. That was pretty cool. Uh, yeah. <laughs> That's one of my highlights. <laughs> I busted open pops. <laughs> <laughs> well, we're never going to be able to do the podcast again. Thanks, Jay. <laughs> Got ahead of yourself. Uh, so you guys have had four members at one point. Mm -hmm. uh, now you guys really only have two, right? Yes. Yeah. yeah like origin. Yeah, it's pretty much just what we're working. And it kind of, yeah, everyone everyone else is just doing their own thing. Mm -hmm. And it's still me and Ryo still trying to be together, like a, be the thing together. Because yeah. we feel like we click together with one. Yeah, you guys taking any uh, applications? Mm. <laughs> any uh, resumes need to be sent your way? Cause, I, think, uh, I think you need a, I think you need a, a mask first. Yeah, you don't apply. fit the prerequisites. I need a mask. Lucha, Lu the, the Lucha part of Lucha Legion, I think, implies you just <laughs> a mask. I that, mean, that was a, yeah, that was a requirement. I, I think it's a prerequisite. Everybody Would you guys be willing to add someone, though, to Lucha Legion? I mean, we would be willing to, like, to work with someone. Yeah, man, like, we can probably... If we like click together, I don't see why not. Sense yeah. you know? of like, tryout yeah. process, <clears throat> sense of auditioning. Is there is there anyone you're <laughs> looking at period. to maybe join the group or or what? Uh, How's like, that going? At the moment, honestly, we're <laughs> just, just focused just on ourselves, like just trying vibing. to. Yeah, we're just going with the rolling with the punches, like yeah, we're man. trying to keep our <clears throat> champions defending them here in the AEPW, man. Yeah. Yeah. Rolling with the punches. Uh, yeah. I've been wanting to talk to you guys about this for a long time because I don't think I've had the. Uh, time or i guess space to really talk to you guys about this oh so infamous match i think jade knows what i'm going to bring up i do, do you? now oh yeah okay. the, uh, right, that right. ladder match yes. oh you man it was old school you just had a ladder yeah. match man they're exciting aren't they well, they are exciting thing, right? yeah, yeah sure. i appreciate it i you know wish i could have inflicted more pain but cut it short you uh, know how things go know, yeah man. how'd that go man how was your ladder match going before inwards or like in the inwards uh, during the match and then after the match, how'd that go? Man, um, that match is something. That's a special match. I'm glad y'all brought it up. Yeah. I'm glad y'all know about it like that. Um, I went in there not knowing much. I was just like, you know, I, was, I said it right now, rolling with the punches. Yeah. Um, uh, so we, we, uh, <laughs> You don't, you don't have to you don't have nah. to expose too much. No, yeah, yeah. But like no, you, you can just I, take I, me through your mindset. Saying, yeah. yeah, your so mindset. In my mindset, it. I'm just like trying to make the best match possible because I'm trying to win the championship Absolutely. with my brother. Make it special. Would like make it a four time. Yeah, like something special. Not, never been done in APW. Really. So I was trying to like bring it like step it up, and I saw that there was people watching. Yeah, and so I I try I gave it my best. I took some bumps, not some, yeah. not not the worst ones of no, the match because no, yeah. I I took the least, <laughs> I, and I'm sorry, I'm sorry, Ryo, I took the least. <laughs> but oh yes, um, I got comfortable. I really wanted more, but it, yeah, it's, man. it was a really good match. And then at the end, uh, it, it it was nominated one one of the three last matches. I mean, best matches. Of the year last year, I saw that. Yeah, yeah you yes, guys were in the for Texas that. Wrestling <coughs> Review. Mm -hmm. So that just being like mentioned in the top three, that was like really, really meaningful for me. Yeah, like, and, and well deserved. It, it was. A yeah, range. you guys absolutely killed each other. Thank you. Thank you. Um, <clears throat> was there a bump in that match that you took that really stood out, or was it all just kind of like it was just a blur? Like you were just you were just going, so you can't really remember. Like what was that like? Um. 
No, I took any. I was already <clears throat> like in my mindset that I was taking some bumps, some, take some pain. lighters. Yeah, yeah, like I knew what I was walking into, especially with old school dominations. Those dudes Those are, dudes are <laughs> crazy. <laughs> no <laughs> hit. Yeah, like, but that's the kind of la- <clears throat> match I like. I like putting them in there, so because that's been a a big problem of mine, not putting that in there as much. So mm-hmm. having to step up with them, that's I need that. Yeah. How did your body feel afterwards? Oh, <laughs> <laughs> man, I was so sore, and um, I I ended up with my best friend after that match. I just couldn't move, and he had, oh he had to go get my food and everything because we were not to eat, and I was like, dude, I can't move. Can you go get him for me? Like, we got drive through and, like, he went and picked it up. I was, like, hurting so bad. I feel, but I feel that, dog. I, I personally took two days off of work after oh, that match. Yeah. yeah. I, I just took that night, and then the next night I had to go back to work. Oh, you yeah. trooper. Dude. Y'all did way worse stuff to your guys' bodies than I did in mine, so I couldn't even imagine. <laughs> God, going to work and just knowing I have that searing pain. Oh, yeah. I also, I've also been to work right after <clears throat> I've been powerbombed through some chairs. That was not fun. And uh, we were talking about it before the podcast, but yeah, you uh, do, you, do you care to mention where you work? Because I feel like that's kind of... Sure. Like, I know it's... It's a it's a <laughs> big switch. I yeah. know. Yeah, I don't mind. Uh, I've been working at a nursing home uh, that is for for the past eight years now. No pun intended. That's insane. <laughs> <laughs> I I really don't mean that as a pun. As Keanu rolls his eyes by the camera. <laughs> mm-hmm. <laughs> no, that's crazy because that's that is such a switch. It it is, and not many people. <clears throat> well, not many people knew, and once they they find out, or I tell them, they're like. Really? Yeah, I had the same reaction. Yeah, what for real? <laughs> yeah, and they don't believe me until I like I actually show them what I actually do, and they're like, "How do you do that? <laughs> like, you do that, and then you come here? Like, yeah. are you kidding me? Like, yeah, like it just happens, huh? <laughs> do most people the uh, the nursing home you work at know that you wrestle? Um, as a like residents, most of them, yes, they do know. Yeah, well, how do they, they feel about yeah. that? Um, like, what they, is their reaction to that? They, of course, they're shocked at, be, at the beginning. Yeah. They, they're like, what, seriously? But some of them get really excited. Like, it's something, like, out of this world for them. It, they can't believe it. Mm-hmm. I, I, to me, I mean, it's just something. This is what you do? It, yeah. It's, do, you, I know. do you always, because I found this whenever uh, my job found out that I do wrestling. Do they always try to bring up, like, super old, like, 50s and, like, 60s wrestlers to you? And does that does that annoy you to some extent? No, actually, nobody, no. Okay. not not many people in my job is a fan of wrestling. Yeah, and if they are a fan of wrestling, it's because of me now. Don't like, I, it's like they, it's just adult, like old people, like <laughs> you know, like moms and stuff, nurses, yeah. like yeah. they weren't into it. Oh, like yeah, Undertaker. <laughs> Yeah, I think <laughs> I might have like one or two coworkers that know. Yeah, uh, it's interesting. Like big names like that. It's interesting to see people's perspective on wrestling from like strictly an outside perspective, because yeah. like to them, the, the, to them, it's like their real exposure in wrestling is like the, those who have crossed over into like movies. Mm-hmm. Yeah, right. Like they're right. aware like, of oh, what I know wrestling Hulk Hogan. is, or I know John Cena, or right. I know or the, the Rock. Rock. Or, yeah, yes. I was gonna say because yes. uh, I I asked that question because and I got confirmation that it does annoy some people. Maybe it annoys you guys because you two nodded your heads. I don't know if you nodded your head or not. <laughs> Uh, yeah, when I told people that I first started wrestling, they're like, "Oh, like you're gonna be like Rey Mysterio," and I was like, "Oh, oh yeah. man," I was like, oh, "I get it." I oh, I, I know okay. what I, I you know what mm-hmm. the one thing that does piss me off something yeah. like that yep. is they always oh like Nacho Libre. Oh, oh I hate oh, that. I'm so like much. that is uh, like I get it like he's a luchador but I don't know it's, it's an obvious it's a comedy. Like, comedy yeah, yeah, yeah like, I'm sure. like <sighs> I don't get that some I, people try but, to tear like wrestling down like that. <laughs> Well, I don't, I'm not going to say the F word, but <laughs> you know, it's not real, right? Yeah. And it's like, yeah, the TV show, right. the Real Housewives of Atlanta isn't real either. Yeah. I mean, you still watch that. But it's, all, it's, where I was like, wow, you know, here I am four months into training and I did not once stop to think, man, I just want to go, oh, <laughs> what? It's not, it's, what am I doing? Oh God, give me out. Like, that's what they want. You, I think that's what the reaction they want is to be like, yeah, yeah, it is. I swear it is. But it's like, dude, we're all adults. Most of the people I talk to that act like that, it's like, dude, we're all adults. Like, that's that's real. It's like, bro, you spent 
you spent four hundred dollars on a Thanos statue, <laughs> bro. <laughs> Come on, <laughs> ask Gizzy Infinity Gauntlet on. <laughs> no, that's fake, right? Yeah, that stuff you do is not real. Yeah, we, 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 we I saw you. I, Man, I saw. I saw you. I saw you watch Cap grab the grab Mjolnir at, at Endgame. <laughs> I heard you scream. I heard you cry. I heard you scream. I know I you got you pop, brother. <laughs> But uh, how did you uh, how did you get into wrestling? Did you, is it just something you started watching as a kid and just kind of yeah, took off from there? It, yes, it really. Um, I was I was little and my grandpa he was the one that would always always watching it and I would sit with him and he was the one that would take me and my brother to the like the lucha shows in Mexico mm -hmm. and uh, I actually my first show that I was in I was like seven months. Like in a little, yeah, I know. Like, what? Like I was in the show, like, not like seven months into your training, or you were no, seven no, no, months. No, no, like you seven, were... Yeah, I was a baby. Oh yeah. man, they took me to a show. <laughs> yeah, they took me to a show. Like, and they just kept me, like, bringing me as like a baby. And so I, it just became like a tradition. Yeah, just I was going. just, yeah, I was just. Dude, I mean, I remember watching that. I remember Pop saying something about it, where like, just because the the lucha culture is so different down there, that mm -hmm. like. Uh, they would bring the bait, like they bring the babies oh, up to like the luchadors. Luchadors. A kiss and yeah, it's like a, like a sign of like like good like a good blessing or something yeah. like that. So I don't know. Maybe, 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 maybe they, I don't know. I mean, <laughs> seven months. I'm sure he doesn't I did, remember. I don't remember because <laughs> I was a baby. <laughs> I mean, maybe that's or part of it's just like well, you know, we got to bring the whole fam whole family down. Yeah, we got a microwave in here. What was that? Chuck cooking mozzarella right. sticks. <laughs> 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 nah. Uh, Jeez, but, that threw me off. I want some mozzarella sticks now. <laughs> yeah, okay, yeah, that's great. So, you, so I guess you grew up on on all the, uh, like the AAA and CMLL. Exactly. And all that it, yes, stuff. my he, my grandpa, he was big on CMLL. He never Ooh. did like AAA because he was it was too gimmicky. Mm -hmm. But CMLL, he I guess he liked the more serious side of wrestling, mm -hmm, and sure. that's what CMLL offered, and that's what I like to watch sometimes here and there. Yeah. And yeah. Do you uh? Not to put you in like a corner or anything, uh -huh. but is there like a, a distinct wrestling show you do like to watch now? Out of all the brands? Oh. Uh Is your one six out the most? I just like <laughs> death matches, honestly. You whoa. Yeah. Dog, what? <laughs> oh my god. Yeah, the AEW <laughs> boy. <laughs> <Hey, look. laughs> what? You don't, get to, you don't get to be insane by me being a catch wrestler. You know? That is that's crazy. How many death matches have you done so far? None. None? So or do you far, plan on doing any? I'm booked for some oh. in May. Yo, do you want to shout out? Yeah, Where can we watch sure. you uh, Those are not going to be live streamed, sadly, but oh, no. I'm flying out to Indiana next month, uh, 13th. I uh, wait, for the Friday the 14th, I think? It's uh, for Trainwreck Wrestling, uh, the Southern Sickness Cup. Is I called, I believe, the tournament. Yeah. And then on Sunday, I'm doing uh, IWA Mid South Ooh, in, that's with them. Nice. So Dog. It's, also, <laughs> it's also a death match. So, also, my first match is uh, qualifying. So, hopefully, if I go over, you if do. I win, then I get a second night. So, oh. it would be three death matches in one weekend, it, which would technically be my first death match I ever. Mean, yeah, you so, hit, the, hit the ground yeah, running on yeah. that. <laughs> Dang, that's sick. Bro, you're gonna be getting like smacked with like light, light tubes, tubes, thumb tags, thumb tags, barbed all wire. This kind of oh crazy. I'm my god! So excited, <laughs> man! It's crazy. I can, not to like alienate myself from that side of wrestling. I can only watch like a death match like maybe once every like three or two months because that is hard to watch. That it, is it, crazy stuff. Yeah, it definitely takes a different kind of mindset to be able to com be, be comfortable watching that mm -hmm. dude or actually enjoy wow. it like you know yeah thinking about it i, I was on twitter <laughs> the other day and i saw someone with the um what is it the wooden spikes oh in their head? dude the, like yeah. how the skewers the skewers, yeah, the skewers they oh, said, like, oh my god yeah. i have never taken those but i have taken light tubes like those kind for of real ones. i've taken those yes i have a scar here in my in my ear that doesn't count as a death match no, because it was just one. Like it was. Like, oh, it was, it was just, just one. Guys. It was just like a regular match, and a la that and it just so lamp happened. just got involved. <laughs> yeah. Uh -huh. okay, so we had the spare light tube around. So just, yeah, I mean, I've done hardcore this? matches, and I wouldn't consider them death matches. Right. Can you um, not to cut you off or anything? I'm uh -huh. Sorry, but uh, can you outline me what is a hardcore and a death match? Because I think I have them confused. I think. Um, uh, I feel like. Hardcore, it's still more 
really focused on wrestling. On the wrestling. Right. Okay. It's still, like, you can still tell a story in a death match, but it's just way more weapons and, like, more gruesome that you would see in a hardcore match. Like, you wouldn't see paints of glasses, uh, barbed wire, well, probably barbed wire in a, in a hardcore. Like yeah, fire, maybe? Yeah, that that's, one, that's one of the things I would never do. Why? I, Why is that? I've seen it go wrong so many times, yeah. and that's... That's fair. I've been, I've been burnt pretty pretty bad sometimes, and I don't like that feeling. So <laughs> you go and putting myself through that is just uh, like yeah. I wouldn't want that on my whole back or anything like that. Right. Yeah. I feel like even in death matches, there's like some propensity to to where you can like what you can take. Yeah, yeah, and I, right. you know, there it sounds like an oxymoron, but there's 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 probably like a safe issue way to take a light tube or something. Is there? <laughs> You know, just get smashed. But yeah, yeah. fire is just so yeah, yeah. unpredictable. It's <laughs> safe word. Exactly. Yeah, yeah this it's so unpredictable is the thing, and that, uh, I like to have some extent of like control. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and that's really scary for me. The fire. That. Oh. Yeah. Do you um? You know what? We should save it for the recount. I want to ask you a question about death matches. Sure. Uh, and as a matter of fact, it is about that time. Unfortunately, we have. <laughs> A short day. We had some technical mishaps. Um, three count. Everyone knows what it is. We should get a three count shirt. I'd wear that on the shows. I'd wear a three count That'd shirt. That'd be cool. Wear a three count People shirt. always need merch. People always do need the problem merch. Is, People the, ask. The problem is, is like, would would it be, would be, we'd have to make it because there's like already a three count technically. Is there? there? Well, yeah, it was like that group in like WCW. Just beat them up. Like Norman Smiley. <laughs> <laughs> they were a rap group. That easy. <laughs> I don't know why Norman That's Smiley right. was in it, but yeah. That's right. They come out. Uh, three but, count. Rico. Okay, I'm not doing it again. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> I heard it. I heard it. Deborah. There you go. Okay. Uh, the three count, it's supposed to be we ask you questions for about like three minutes as fast as we can. It's supposed sure. to be rapid fire. Okay. But we just work here. Say the line, Jay. Say the line. Hey, zoom in. Oh, wait. You can't zoom in on me right now. <laughs> say the line, Jay. We just work here. Say it. Say it. Say it. You got to say it. Say it. It's not you. Say it. Say it. Say it. Say it. Felix, get on the mic. Felix, tell him to say it. Hey, they don't choose wisely. Okay, he, we just work here. God, <laughs> dude, you always break the bit. Um, so yeah, we're just gonna ask you. We're all just gonna ask you our own questions. That's our form of the three count. Sure Answer for as long as you want to, or as short as you want to. We don't care. I'm not gonna say the line again because you messed up the bit. Damn it. We just work here. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. Yes. Okay. Uh, what is your favorite death match of all time? Uh, Jun Kasai versus uh, Takeda. Oh. Lord, yeah. that came out way okay. too fast. So, that scares yeah. me. <laughs> Don't do you, know sick. you should. Uh, can I watch? Can the people? Can I watch that on YouTube? Yes. You should absolutely see it, that. It's a, it's a two part, and yes, it's a thirty minute match. It's a good one. Lord have mercy. Was it like one of the like the frontier martial arts like barbed wire exploding death matches ones, or was it just like a? No, it was just a regular match. I, I think it was bareboard, or they ended up stripping the yeah, and it was just crazy bones, and it's. Yeah, those dudes are crazy, and Dang. and and Jun Kasai is like one of my favorite deathmatch wrestlers, if not the one. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so that, Why? yeah, <laughs> that, that match is just wild, man. God, y'all need I, to watch it. I need. I'm I'm going to if you send it to me. <laughs> okay, uh, next question. P boys, stand up. Um, <laughs> I halfway want to ask your question just because it didn't get asked, and I, oh, you should. I, I usually cut you off because I know it's coming. Uh, <laughs> uh, hold on, my, my my question is actually kind of similar to that one. Okay. Uh. Well, yeah. Then uh, your your favorite pay per view. My favorite pay per view. <laughs> like, was there a, a card that really stood out to you? Um. Yes. Well. Uh. Again, GCW. Uh. Wow. Take. Wait. No. Uh, what's it called? Um. Uh, they said it couldn't be done. They brought Jun Kasai, and I was able to fly out to see him live. Oh, snap. so yeah, oh, you were there. I was there right to on. see him live, and that was my like my one and only time that I've seen him. Dope. So, that was a good card. They had Matt Tremont versus G Raver. That's a good dead match. Uh, they had Jun Kasai versus Alex Colon. That's a really good death match. The uh, Jimmy Lloyd versus Eric Bryan and. Uh, I can't remember who it was, but it was a triple three. Oh, Marcus Crane. That's a death match as well. It was God. Eh. And then you also, in between those death matches, you had regular matches. You had like a scramble, you Teddy Hart's in it, uh, uh, some other people. I can't remember. It's <laughs> just a wild card. Mm -hmm. Nice. It's a really well combined 
deathmatch and wrestling. Good God. Yeah. I think this is our first, uh, not from like a one of the big major promotions, as somebody said. That, that That's true. Yeah. Well, I think, well, no, Arrow, yeah, he had a major promotion too. Yeah. Go ahead, and Felix, uh, yeah. Mr. Stable. Uh, I my question is: uh, Is there any? Do you have any dream insane attire that you would, or mask get up that you would want to to have someday? I am actually waiting on. Ooh. I just ordered some. some gear. Yeah. They, I should be getting some pictures tonight. Ooh. I know. Uh, it's. I don't want to really say much, but it's based on. Uh, King from Tekken. Yes, oh, yes. my boy. Nice. Video game boys. Really yes. I, I grew up playing that, that game, and just yeah, I put so my, many hours in it. Tekken Four was like the game that came out like as I was growing right. up. So I, that yeah, I King has this like he, one of his costumes is he's got the like the, wi- the the white pants and like the the blue button up with the sequins oh. and oh, stuff on yes. it. Oh. Looked, yeah. And his hair's down. His he looks clean. Yeah. Yeah. He's got the drip. It's, yeah. He's he's the drip. God, we're going to see does. drip insane. Yeah, drip. Insane drip. <laughs> insane, insane drip. drip. Insane drip. Make it a shirt, baby. I'll let you have insane that one. Drip. I'll take no no taxes on that. No. But, um, taxes. Unfortunately, we do have to end it insane. No, uh, but first, a word from our sponsor man himself. Oh, are you doing Looking do at that camera. Right. Oh, wait. The camera's wait. not over there. Felix the plug. Yeah, it's over here now. Ooh, hello. Yeah. Zoom in. So the cool part is... <laughs> cool. <laughs> the cool part about uh, AAPW is that the second A stands for uh, Academy. It's our school. Oh. So you can always look us up on our website or come down here yeah, and sign up and join us. It's great. We also have shows, yeah, we do. I think, weekly. That was smooth. Weekly? Yeah. Um, you know, we're working, on, we're working on a schedule. Fairly consistent shows <laughs> on Saturdays. <laughs> Switch.tv slash official AAPW. Official right. AAPW on all social media as well. Yeah, yeah, we uh, if you want to give us a follow there. Um we also always have merch yeah, we uh, at our shows uh, of our of our wrestlers. They bring their t-shirts out there because they gotta yeah, they gotta do. they gotta pay some bills. You know what I'm Get the insane <laughs> merch. Get the Lucha Everybody Legion merch. The Lucha Legion merch. Show, show them the merch. Show them the, show merch. Show the drip. The insane drip you got drip. on right now, young man. Oh, okay, <laughs> well <laughs> turn the camera off. Lucha <laughs> Legion baby. God damn. Uh, you can also go on Teespring.com for uh, APW specific merch. Uh, yes. uh, I still don't know if Pop It On the fifty percent off is still active or not. And you know what? The world will never know. So keep trying. Yeah, go go buy something and see if it works. I don't I don't know. But, uh, and also, Buckle Bomb episodes come out every approximate week, so make sure you subscribe to our YouTube channel to watch Buckle Bomb, to watch promos, <laughs> and to watch uh, replays and VODs of our past shows. Very good. Mm-hmm. Indubitably. That was smooth, man. Thanks, yeah, man. man. That was smooth. I'm getting better the more mustache. we do them. <laughs> you have to rub your mustache in that, too. What a good day this was. <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm getting. I might say, That's what I'm, made it a good I, day. Is Felix got to rub his mustache? Yeah, look at his mustache. Zoom in on the mustache. Zoom no, on shoot, the don't mustache. zoom in on the mustache. <laughs> 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 he has a good mustache, people. Better than most. But yeah, uh, that'll do it for this no episode. Thank you, Insane. Thank we you. really guys. appreciate it. I would love to come back again whenever. Yes, talk sir. Way more. Yeah, we gotta get some yeah, of these yeah, short, short episodes after your, uh, after your death matches. You oh talk about those. man, I would love to give you the insight on those. There you go. You can show us the stars. I'll be all ears. Oh, yeah, right. yeah, I'll be right. definitely down, man. We got the uh, death knock on our door, so uh, yeah. we will see you guys next time. We're out. Peace. Right.